Hello, my dear global family. So welcome to Global Prey Chain. This is a part of um, Global Peace Building uh, Network, Global Peace Building Forum. To finish Ultima Global Peace by 2027, every quarter of the world, every family, community, country in the world. And this is possible because this predestination for all uh, human beings uh, to enjoy peace and love in their family, community, country in the world. Are you believe in this if yes uh, or not uh, write your comment your vision in the chat subscribe the channel and share this message to billions uh, uh, this is a video for you this meeting is specifically for you as we are doing in the direct presence of god so um there were so many miracles in our meetings, uh, as uh, spiritually said that uh, billions of spirits are watching these uh, meetings. So let's go uh, with the meeting. Uh, you could uh, join this meeting uh, alive or uh, in Global Prey Chain. Uh, join this uh, meeting. One minute. Pray at your local time at 7 p.m. This prime time dedicated to God. And God could give you 95% for the 5% of human potential for your uh, life and family and business and organization everywhere you are. So uh, let's uh, go with the meeting. Uh, more about how you could join, uh, send a donation and uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, join volunteering uh, our global team. Let's uh, start the meeting with the song. Sing along.
So calming song to attract love and healing in your relationships. Uh, let's go with the quotes. The words of God from Messiah and coming. No matter how impressive someone may look, if you analyze that person, say it is Mr. Uh, Obama, <laughs> we will find the struggle between uh, her inner self and out, outer self. I am telling you that uh, the outer person and inner person are constantly confronting each other. This is undeniable. Within each of you, the good mind and evil body are always fighting each other. This battle is the problem. What is the source? Where it is the origin? It is original at the very beginning of human history. It appears as uh, this battle may continue on for tens of thousands of years. You are fighting right now. You are fighting guns through your life, uh, irrespective uh, of how you arrange uh, things in this world. Your body and mind are fighting each other. How can you bring peace between them? Will your body win this battle or will your mind? You need to become people who say, who can say, without a doubt, my mind will become victorious. Those whose minds are victorious are on the side of good, while those whose bodies are victorious are on the side of evil. To this day, people have endured constant struggles between their minds and bodies. That is, uh, we have never seen a day of peace and unity, a day that would allow us to run toward the clear goal in accord with moral laws. Since the entire course of history has unfolded while our bodies and mind have been in conflict, there has been no way to avoid the division into two worlds, one oriented spiritually, another materially. If we were originally designed with uh, our body and mind conflict, things such as ideal peace and systems uh, of uh, thought would not be nothing but uh, empty words spoken in vain. If we were created uh, not to struggle internally, then there will be a purpose for ideals, peace and systems of thought. It is uh, illogical that uh, people born with a uh, inherited inner conflict could uh, come up with the concept of true ideas and peace. In all respects, we are resultant beings, not casual beings. We were brought into being by a cause, and as a resultant beings, our existence must be consistent with that cause. Cause and effect cannot uh, be different. A resultant being is formed from the substance of a casual being. So we can conclude that uh, we, as a result, are not inherently different from the cause and uh, where must be process uh, by which we can unite. That is scientific. The, the original mind, which is God's base, is the guard post of the kingdom of heaven. The body, which the Satan bears, is the guard post of hell, they are on the opposite sides of a border. You can hear gunshots across the border. This is the sound of your original mind fighting with your body. Until you win this war, you cannot become God's children and you cannot go to the heavenly nations without this victory. As the starting point, the kingdom of heaven and the ideal world cannot be realized. Okay, so powerful quotes for today. Let's go with the global uh, forum. And uh... hello, hello, hello. So good. Uh, okay, uh, let's start our prayer meeting. Uh, please join my prayer. Uh, dear Heavenly Parents, we are so happy to meet you alive here. As uh, we learn from the quotes, uh, there is a big struggle between mind and body. But we are so thankful that you, with your true love, uh, through the Messiah's incoming, you give us rebirth and uniting, healing this uh, mind and body struggle. And uh, we understand that uh, 
true love may come only when we are absolutely united with the heavenly parent uh, dear heavenly parent uh, we understand that uh, for the five percent of our uh, human potential that was historically impossible to break through you give 95 of uh, your potential so thus we could raise uh, again dear heavenly parent uh, so happy to bring this uh, um, prayer this uh, wish for the world this uh, great work that we are doing united universities and coming finishing uh, uh, global peace by 2027 building dear heavenly parent uh, as we pray for all 8 billion plus people because all of us uh, all human beings we are like cells 8 billion cells of one human body and if there is a problem as we see now in uh, eastern europe and the uh, and the uh, Middle East and all other 30 points, uh, hot points of the world, we understand that uh, not only we as uh, one body, one uh, parts of the body, all uh, cells, but uh, God is suffering because you are living with us. Dear family parents, we are so sorry about this and uh, we are working daily to resurrect. We are working daily to uh, fix this. Uh, with the science and religions everything is developing as we see recently so big development globally dear heavenly parent uh, i really came to pray with a great uh, um, thankful mind for that you are taking care of each of us of uh, every human beings as we understand the bible you um warn us that uh, you know how many hairs we have how many cells we have and uh, you are really taking care of all the things and even if you are running uh, all day personally or our family or uh, full countries and the globe uh, all human beings you are doing 95 percent for each one of us we are so thankful for this does uh, i came to pray uh, with a great uh, heart or thankful for um uh, representatives who of humanity who came here as we pray for all eight billion plus people uh, i pray for james uh, kolawole in nigeria and as uh, he is in the uh, health recovery now i pray for his health and for his family and uh, for his country and uh, for all africa and i'm in uh, europe dear heavenly parent uh, pray for europe Dear Heavenly Parent, we really pray that you will be done. Time will be done. Let you with, uh, will uh, as uh, the cause of the, this universe fulfill as soon as possible. Dear Heavenly Parent, we meet daily already 608 meeting, And uh, we meet, meet it every day and uh, pray with all our heart for the world. Dear Heavenly Parent, we are leading uh, Global Peace Building Network uh, every day, every hour, every second, that uh, all human beings could uh, attract uh, true love in their family, in their community, country, and the world, that they could attract prosperity, uh, abundance, uh, receive salvation and blessing and healing, uh, miracles of healing. Let uh, these uh, prophecies uh, that was uh, impossible to be done and uh, wrote in the Bible, Bible till now, let it fulfill as soon as possible, right today, right in this day. Let this say uh, you will be done, dear Heavenly Parent. Uh, I came to pray, to unite together with you and with Messiah and coming. As we are living in this uh, Messiah and coming time, I pray with all my heart uh, for the uh, only God Son and only God Daughter that you send to this uh, earth nowadays. Dear Heavenly Parent, I pray with all my might for them. Please uh, lead them, lead them, uh, lead them uh, as they build Heavenly Kingdom. Ole already 11th year, uh, let this kingdom make a great, uh, uh, great uh, impact in every human life. Let this uh, uh, kingdom that is uh, finished already, 11th year, let it uh, be inherited in every human uh, uh, family, community, country, and the whole world. Dear Heavenly Parent, lead us uh, to unite together with you and do everything together with you uh, to do your will. Dear Heavenly Parent, we really want to understand your will. We really want to uh, meet the specific persons uh, uh, that you sent to our lives uh, 
the, to unite together and build the kingdom in every country. Let this uh, this uh, wish, this uh, great will be done uh, as you wish, dear Heavenly Parent. I pray for all uh, brothers and sisters who join uh, our meeting, uh, simple people, also uh, those from politicians and uh, from uh, religious field and uh, those from uh, uh, businessmen and all other and politicians uh, to came with the visions for peace, who came their reports for peace. Uh, dear Heavenly Parent, I really uh, want to unite together with you and join together with you. Let's uh, join hands together and build peace substantially. Dear Heavenly Parent, to pray for all uh, uh, bishops, archbishops, uh, um, even the Pope, uh, all religious leaders, to unite together as one uh, uh, global family with the politicians, um, um, with the um, media person, with businessmen, with everyone. Dear Heavenly Parent, lead us, lead us to unite together with you and do everything together with you. Dear Heavenly Parent, now is the time that uh, uh, we could build Heavenly Kingdom in our uh, family, community, country, the world. Let this kingdom as Messiah inspire us to unite mind and body on true love, to unite and uh, do this. Finally, this is possible. Uh, as uh, the Messiah, only God and Son, only God and Daughter, uh, true parents, they build Heavenly Kingdom and they open the era of direct presence of God. And thus we could be with you, Heavenly Parent, not just in difficulties at West till now, uh, in the life of the situation, but to all days, every day, every hour, every second, thus we pray, please help us to uh, find finance, to, to advance your uh, work, to find people, even more people, even more finance that we find till now, that, that uh, we could... Uh, uh, in this abundant world, understand you and uh, do your will. Dear Heavenly Parent, please lead us, lead each one of us who, who joined this meeting, those who uh, have uh, miracles uh, watching this uh, video, those who are sharing these videos, uh, those who are really uh, enjoy living with God. Heavenly Parent, uh, we are so happy to build the kingdom together with you, uh, United People Organizations, and let's uh, do your will. Uh, dear Heavenly Parent, please receive this uh, uh, short report this day and uh, lead us as we approach to the Christmas, as we uh, approach to the new year. Uh, let's unite together and take uh, have a new ourselves uh, with uh, you, great, uh, powerful, uh, um, mightly true love. Please receive this short report uh, and this day I pray in my name as Nikolai Kerpala Center Plus Family. Adieu, Amen, Amen, Amen. Yes, for today. Our Father and our God, we thank you for today. We thank you for the peace. We thank you for all you have done. We thank you because, because you are existing in our life. That is why we are alive. If you are no more in us, we will have gone. We thank you for this grace and mercy. Please accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Father, as we are colliding together, as we are doing things together, in one accord to bring peace and pray for peace for all the nations, for the countries of the world. Father, let your will be done in Jesus' name. Amen, Father, amen, pray, amen. We have few seconds, James. Jesus, thank you. In Jesus' name. Thank you, thank amen. you. Amen. <laughs> Yeah, pray for you. Stay happy, healthy. Please recover quickly. <laughs>